Yo, 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 it's your boy AK Electro, and today what I got for you guys, as you can tell by the title and the thumbnail of the video, is how to complete collections really, really quickly in MLB The Show 21 Diamond Dynasty mode. Before we do get into the video, please don't be afraid to go drop a like and subscribe down below. As well, check out the links in the description. My Twitter and Twitch, I stream over there almost daily around uh, 10 p.m. Eastern or earlier. Uh, but you can catch daily streams. And then also, as I said earlier, don't be afraid to subscribe. And then drop a comment if you have some controversy on whatever I say today. And let's get into the reason you're here. Okay, as you guys can tell by the screen, this is my team right now. I've pretty much been no money spent. I dropped a hundred on the the game uh, just to buy it, and then out of those packs, I bought a hundred bucks worth of packs on opening night. Besides that, I haven't put any money in, and the hundred bucks I did put, I pulled packs and I pulled nothing. So it really didn't give me any sort of head start. Besides that, I've just been grinding the game. Uh, I've had some luck with some free packs, but the, everyone's gonna have at least some luck and pull something out of free packs. But let's get into the reason here. So the first thing when completing collections is you're going to want to do these inning programs. It's the biggest thing possible. These inning programs are at least a free 50k and you get so much free things. As you can tell, I am completely maxed out. And if you get completely maxed out, that's going to be tons and tons of XP and or tons of XP you need. And you're going to get tons of little goodies throughout that you can use for stubs and just buy things. This diamond ball player is uh, like 40k in that pack, at least 40k. This live series is 30k. That's 70k right there, and that can buy you a 89 overall that you need. 10 packs, 10 packs, 10 packs. And then, as you know, obviously the big guy in here is inning bosses, and these sell for 50k. There's at least 200k XP or 200k stubs to be made in here and get collections done. Next up is team affinities. You do showdowns, as you probably already know, and do these team affinities. Yes, team affinities are going to help you get collections done, but, 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 they're free. As you see, I've already been grinding them, and you get 2,500 stubs throughout. You get free packs. You get these players. You get ball in packs, and ball ins and team affinities aren't, the ball ins are guaranteed gold. You can pull a diamond possibly. I've never pulled a diamond this year, but you're going to get plenty of packs. And it's just the free content's gonna add up, as you can already tell what I'm saying. These are the free things. And then next, another free thing that you guys can knock out is these conquests. Conquest is pretty easy. You just do these. You can see I, I haven't done one actually. I haven't needed. And but you can do these. It's free, free, free. That's all I'm gonna get to. These are free things. Just add up, add up, add up. These aren't the big things yet. These aren't the big things yet at all. And then next up, you got moments. You probably already know, knock these out. That's a free thousand. And you can sell these player, players. Big things are, I haven't even knocked these out. I'm so close to collections. Um, but you can get these moments, sell those diamonds for 6, 8K right now. That's 8K. You know, Aaron Nola costs 10K. That's a free diamond towards your collection. You got to think of it like that. Okay, and then lastly, um, the big thing, not even lastly, I forgot to say, I, I don't know what to say, is BR. The biggest thing and the quickest thing is getting 12-0 and 0 in BR and finishing. As you can tell, I've been grinding this. I've already gotten Cremente and I've sold him, and I've already gotten George Brett and I sold him. Grinding this is going to get you your stubs. Last uh, season for this, it was Solaire went for 50k, and then it was these. That went for like 100k at the time when I got them. You're gonna want to grind that out. You're gonna get 100k just from grinding it out. And then also, if you go 12 and one, which I've done, I've gotten trout two times going 12 and one. That's what's helped me. This is gonna be the quickest way possible to get collections done. Any good player you're gonna catch doing the this, playing PR and going 12 and 0. That's my best advice: is get on BR. Grind it out. Get them nine wins. Nine wins is pretty much a severe a, thunderstorm warning has been issued for your location. Okay, thank you. Um, an eighty nine, an eighty five to eighty nine is going to give you twenty k at least, and that's a diamond that you're done. So as you can tell, there's not any secret that I have that I've used to get this far on collections. Um, there's not really any secret. Uh, it's really just grinding free content, the inning program, the showdowns, team affinities, grinding that out, getting your XP, and then going 12-1, 12-0 in BR and grinding everything out. Uh, 
they made it super easy in these past couple years where you can just grind. If I didn't go 12 1 to BR, I would still probably have the NL done because of um, all the inning programs and all that. Um, it helps that I went 12 and 1 in BR, but it's not a necessity. I would just say grind out the free content, the conquest, the team affinities, and the inning program. That's my greatest advice to you, and I appreciate you guys tuning in today. And don't be afraid to drop a like if you are new, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out. It's your boy, K Electro.